Ms. Kofi Annan's development chief as the administrator of UNDP, you know, I and several of his staff literally went into the proverbial um, windowless co uh, committee room and wrote the MDGs. And uh, I have uh, spent many a year since wishing I'd taken a little bit more time to write them, uh, as I might have made them slightly more uh, inclusive and polished. Uh, uh, but they were sort of taken from big UN summits, which had established these, these, these different goals. And uh, there were certain political parameters that we were working within, which prevented us from being as explicit about uh, women's reproductive health as we might have liked, prevented us being as explicit about the promotion of democracy as we might have wanted. Uh, but nevertheless, these, these goals, clumsy though they are, you know, bec have become, in a sense, the first primitive effort of a global society to create a global social safety net. Uh, and it is quite astonishing the difference they have made. People always you know, like to point to the terrible continuing poverty in many parts of Africa to suggest the MDGs have failed. But in fact, the principal MDG, the halving of world poverty by 2015, from the baseline of, of, of 1990, will have happened. And across many African countries, uh, things like universal, universal primary school enrollment will have been achieved. Uh, there will have been striking improvements in maternal mortality in many parts of the world, including some very, very poor countries indeed. So while it will be a spotty performance, the fact is that the act of establishing goals and of cooperating around their achievement by applying uh, Western and other aid programs uh, to uh, their fulfillment through the vehicle of recipient governments which really prioritized health and education uh, as the objectives of their development in these years is a striking early little noticed effort of the world working together in, in a collaborative way. But I describe in the book how the real ambitions of the MDGs, which you know, um, in a sense fall short of, of, of what many of us might have hoped for because they are a little bit of an orphan out there as a first effort to cooperate around uh, reducing global poverty. But the thought that they might have led to much more formal arrangements, and there were lots of efforts to do it, the UN summits, but a big G8 meeting at Glen Eagles. Time after time, uh, the world's security interests got in the way. Mm -hmm.